Justice Court is back in session. I'm Al Reynolds, and this is the Court of Public Opinion. I'll be serving as your judge, and you, the viewer, will be the jury. The Court of Public Opinion is a place where you, the people's voice, can and will be heard. Be sure to hit that like button. Be sure to hit that follow button or subscribe button. If you haven't subscribed, please share if you have not shared the show so that we can get more people in here. Hey y'all, it's your girl Millie Chun. And Al Reynolds had me so weak behind all that, especially in those first 10 seconds. <laughs> so there was no Fox Soul last night. Al was on his YouTube page. Uh, what's her name? The Red Wine Girl that was on Ready to Love. She was on there and there was another lady on there. So we all know that Al has expressed that he has been in a hostile working environment. And we heard him on Funky Dineva's Live. <clears throat> and the straw that broke the camel's back seemed to have been Armand Wiggins' roast of him. Not saying that's the reason, but definitely it, it, it sent him over a cliff. Now, Claudia has had conversations with people that she probably should not have had conversations with. She spoke to uh, Tasha K. Tasha K has gone on her platform. She has said who Claudia likes, who Claudia doesn't want to work with, who should she replace Funky Dineva with, things of that nature. And it has not worked out well for her in the end. I think we all would like to know why would Claudia confide into this particular person, right? Because now we know everything that you've said. We know how you feel. Al knows how you feel. Funky knows how you feel. And Armand knows how you feel. Because you, allegedly, she said you said you did not like any of them. And there have been text messages out here in the world that can back it up. So this is a bad space for Claudia, but this was in her story today. She said, betrayal hurts, especially when you already forgave once, but I won't let it turn my heart cold. I'll vent a little for a couple of days, then adjust my crown and get back to work like I always do. But sadly, I can't say I'm surprised. There's always signs we ignore because we want to believe, but they wouldn't do me like that. I've been too good to them. Guard going back up. And this was her last one. She was talking about manifestation, right? Um, Claudia is crafty, right? She's going to find something and she's going to work at it. Now, everything she does doesn't always stick. I would actually like to see Claudia back on The Housewives. I think now she has it and she would be great. Um, but she feels a certain way and I get that. So Armand went on his page and he said that his roast was not the reason that the show is on hiatus. He said that they were getting ready to go on a vacation break anyway for a week. He said also that it may sweeten the narrative to say that he was the one that ended the show. And then he went on to say that he wasn't going to get into why it was on hiatus and everything else so maybe we'll hear about that later but he also said some things like i don't know if people have gotten into his psyche he said that he was talking to someone and he realized that he may not be a likable person you know like armand has a particular audience he talks about particular things i do however agree with tasha k he may not have a vast focus on everything like he he can't just really get into all the conversations but if he does what he needs to do of course he can do that now i don't know he just got on there so we got to give him a chance but when they come back from hiatus will he be back that's the question so you all do remember that after the roast this was al's post hello guys today's show has been canceled as i am dealing with some internal issues on what is supposed to be my birthday weekend see y'all soon so he posted that shortly after that roast situation so we just gotta see what's gonna happen now tasha k did like go back and forth but she did say some good things about fucking Aniva. she said that you know he's able to speak vastly about different things where she feels like Armand can't right um she said that 
she has spoke to funky dineva now he has debunked a lot of stuff you can go over to his page with this he's debunked a lot of stuff now there is some things that he agreed with but he also told his truth about things that she said so she said that you know he was really wanting to save the show because he carried the show funky has a large audience right i would have to agree with that and one reason that he was trying to ask for more money is because she said that he knew the show would fail when he left i can see that because the numbers have fallen but what do you all think about all of this we're going to talk about this wednesday too it's your girl millie chan i'll talk to y'all later bye